Okay. All right. Let's look at the word continue it. All right? The word continuity, right? <clears throat> it means the unbroken and consistent existence or operation of something over a period of time. You hear that? Right? The unbroken consistent existence or operation of something over a period of time. The act is more dangerous to you. The act we commit is more dangerous to you than the continuity. Why not? Because when you do something, and when you do something to somebody, especially like in the case of a stigma or anything like that, once you put that out there, like that the Bible tells you, right? Because people may say, yo, I don't believe in a God, I may not believe in a Bible and something here. First thing, I don't believe in a things. I try, try my best to know things. And the only way for me to know God, right, is to have an inner God. A God where is within. You understand me? I say so. Means like a representation of God. You understand me? I say. So I don't really believe in a God. Yeah? Me know God. See? And what God represents for me is right? Duality. High and low, hot and cold. You see me I say? Good and bad, etc. Yeah? But it has to come with balance. There must be balance. Me can't just do bad and sprinkle some good on it and expect say yo that is not gonna affect me negatively or have some negative impact on my existence over a period of time. Me must expect say when me do fuckery, there's a continuity when me have to deal with. It. Because like say me come so boom now and stigmatize somebody. I'm gonna put a stain on somebody. Right? When me stigmatize you and a hundred people take the stigma or the lie and run with it. The hundred people they spread it to another hundred people or two hundred people and the two hundred spread it to a thousand and the thousand spread it to ten thousand and the ten thousand spread it to a hundred thousand and the hundred thousand spread it to a million people. And that lie becomes the truth to some people. Now you will commit the act. You are responsible for all of that, you know. So your existence, throughout your existence, you know it's, a, it's a your existence, the unbrokenness of it, you know. You have to go deal with that throughout your whole existence. And your existence now stop when you just leave earth. These are just the flesh part. These are just the physical but we have a thing called the consciousness. You see? We have a thing called the consciousness, you know. So the physical, it has to go back to the earth. But that's not it. Because here we go now. We are dealing with existence. And we know so we mind exists. You see? We know so the consciousness exists. Some people just have different name when them label things for things, things, things what we call soul and consciousness and people just have different words what them use, different English words or whatever words them use. But your existence is not just about the physical. So when you bear false witness against your neighbor, just know say 
there's gonna be an unbrokenness in a your sin because here we go now you set up a chain of lies of 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 a false witness against your neighbor that's why in the commandment it says you're not to do it don't even bother do it nobody tell no lie upon somebody you know say a lie you tell and you still tell the lie and even when you tell the lie you know come correct the lie early out you know come fix the lie early out you watch the lie spread you see you watch the lie spread and spread and spread and spread and it becomes a mountain and when it becomes a mountain because it's it's so big now you can't even but go back now go say a lie you did a tell because it has gotten out of hand it has gotten so big so for your whole existence you're gonna have to deal with that mountain and it's gonna be a hard fucking mountain to climb you see understand that so that that, that when you see a person start deal with the 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 the, 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 the repercussion of, of um them deeds when you see a person start face the negative impacts of them deeds you have to just you say yo just spread your bed sleep in night the say go Get ready to set up the goal for me. Just get ready to set up the goal for me. May I tell you now that? Remember that. You see? Because all that hurt around. A sickness may just come in. A sickness may just come and it can just happen to anyone of you. And if you're not prepared for it, it can be devastating. It can be very, very devastating. Especially we're getting older now. So always know, see, see throughout earth, throughout earth, try always a positive energy up. Go through your portal then. You see? Always a keep positive energy flowing through your portal then that means a goodness and mercy follow you that means a food upon your table that means your cup are full and a run over that means a blessings are coming upon you every day you get up you sing i am blessed i am blessed say it put it into existence that's why we sing the song we say you're blessed you understand me i say i mean i say you are blessed me say i am blessed so when you sing it you're singing i i you see what i say? that's why the bible say i am the i am you understand me i say and that you know that's why they say God is the I am. I am the I am. So when you say I am blessed, you sing it every morning. Every morning you get up and you sing it. <clears throat> you see? Every night you come home, you sing it. You see? You put positive energy through your portal. You, I am blessed. I am blessed. You see? I am successful. I am winning. I am victorious. You see? A lot of people they want to victimize you. They want to, they want you to continue to be a victim. So whatever you go through in a life, that is the reason why I tell my story them, you know. Because I'm not still a victim. I no matter if you're still because some people want to use a story to ridicule or to keep you as a victim. Case in point where I'm to me a three-year-old. I tell the world. That means say you can't have that over me. And when you think say attack and you ridicule me, no, me already, me already passed the victim stage. Me bless. <coughs> you understand that? Me reach a blessed stage. Me higher than me higher than where I try to. Me further than where I try to. Me past death so already. And you know that powerful to take me back there. You see? Yeah. Because me I put positive energy through my portal. And it reminds me when me see a karma come. It reminds me to be a good person. It reminds me, say, yo, if me hurt people, me for repent. It reminds me, say, yo, me must be true to the people and me true to me. It reminds me, say, yo, don't make you have your foot in my neck and me go and like seven lay down just a ball. Follow pepper seed root. You put your foot in my neck a war. No matter who you are. You see? 
Because, no, because me have a higher self, me also have a lower self. They have come down here and deal with it like a drunk or two, like pepper seed. And they will fly out from down here and go back in our higher self. But we not stay high up all the time, because if we stay high up all the time, that circuit they are going overloaded with too much positivity. Because if you have a positive thing, only a try to send light. You have to burn down the house. You need negative and positive to get the light here. So when we see you reach a point now as a major, major figure in this place, this place we try to mash up so much youth. We try to hurt so much youth. We try to destroy so much females. And all of them things in the industry. I know me come see how we are 39, 99 knockoff. Me have to point it out and remind yourself this are your existence. This are your karma. This are your judgment. You could have buy a thousand dollar one tomorrow if you just show me say you can buy the thousand one too. Me still get to see how we are a knockoff 39, 99. And that is inclusive of taxes. I mean, if you see a flap on the shoe, where the little youth where try to tear down, mash up, it reminds me, say, yo, try do good, try be good. That not teach me, say, yo, don't bother call up the man name, start a walk to some man or call up the man name. No, it reminds me, say, yo, you, 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 I, try and do good, be good. When you see people fall, don't step in at them neck and try to keep them down. Try to give them a helping hand and lift them up. So it teach me to because you, your lesson, me I learn from your lesson because your existence, your unbrokenness is here. We have to live through it, the continuity. You see? Right, brother, I'm up. <clears throat> yeah. So nobody thinks say, me have a giant crowd. The silent crowd. When no one say you did a try to stop something. When no one say you did a try to tear down something. When no one say that try to prevent something from happening. And when me see the something happen now because it was destined. And me see you have to try to go now and I try to embrace what you try to stop. Me have to say no, that is a tree that was planted by the water where you try to tear up. But because it's planted by the water, it cannot be moved or it could not be moved. So you have to just watch it grow and now you have to climb it. I all look fruits from it. You see? So you soon get a song with the man we are trying to tear down. Because so it go. I just the existence. You see what I say? Life is a cycle. Mm -hmm. Just understand how life works, man. So no matter feel like say, if you're out here and you agree with a person's behavior. The man I think say if you agree with a person's behavior, if it ridicule, tear down, stigmatize, break people down, whatever they try to do to people. Nobody thinks say, oh, they can sprinkle some goodness on top of evil. Nobody thinks you can sprinkle some goodness on top of corruption and things say it not stop corrupting. So nobody thinks you can point out say, yeah, that person they help enough people in a dance hall, but through him bring down them one day and through him help them one day, him is a good person. No, for you have a sore foot. No matter what, it's a sore foot. No matter if it gets better, it's still a sore foot until it is fully healed. It is still a sore. So now come tell me, say, you sprinkle a little goodness from bad, and I tell me, say, it is good. No! No matter come tell me, say, the bottom of the bucket is dirty, but because you're throwing clean water, the water is clean. The water is contaminated because the vessel is contaminated. So you could have pointed out from now till God. How much thing a person do for somebody, like how the pastor feed the whole community, but him a molest the little girls, him a molest the little boys, them. Because what? The vessel is contaminated. You mm see? -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's why the Bible tells us that your body is the church. That's what tells us your body is the temple of God. And we don't read Bible and believe Bible like how we don't believe Bible. We don't take it literally. We look at it from a metaphysical point of view or an allegorical point of view. They understand the message. So we understand it from the angle. And when we understand it from the angle, we learn a lot. It tells us your body is the temple of God. What that means say, yo, you have always keep your body clean because God is within. Is what I say. God is within. So you have to keep the vessel clean. 
So that means that if you have the wickedness, but you do wickedness to half of the people, them, and do goodness to half of the people, them, that means that you're a good person. No, your vessel is unclean. You see me? I said, that's why politics couldn't work in a Jamaica because the politicians them, them come and go and let them do good, but the foundation is contaminated. What politics was built on is contaminated. The system where politics designed from is contaminated. The base is contaminated. The hierarchy is contaminated. The monarchy is contaminated. You see me? I said, so it can't be good at any point. You see? He can show you attributes and fool you. Like politics, good for you and I'm going to come around and I'm going to help you. No, 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 it can't be good. You see? It can't be good. So don't want to come come and sprinkle little goodness by evil. I look at goodness by corruption and things that not, you know, you know, you know, you know, still corrupted. That is putting band-aid over sore foot. You see? You take off the band-aid and then it stink and rotten seam when you're full of maggots. You have to clean it out. Clean it out and start a new, new dress now, watch it heal. You see? That you have to understand people. Life is a cycle. You see? And the continuity is more dangerous than the act. Understand that the continuity is more dangerous than the initial act. Does know that no man? Because remember now you created disciples, you know. When you do wickedness to people, you know, you created disciples. You know? it's, like, it's like the man where he decides he wants to turn the down. And he recruit a hundred more youth or fifty more or twenty more youth. And them youth there, go out there and kill a bag of people. Go out there and create a bag of wickedness. Go out there and rob people, innocent people and terrorize innocent people. You know who are the BS? You know who are the foundation of all this? The done. You see? So everything come back to the, to, to the center. Everything come back to the nucleus, you know. So if, you are, the, the, the new, if the nucleus is contaminated, what you, what you expect from all of the, 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 the things that we have come from the nucleus? The center is contaminated, you know. Is it? So you're going to have to deal with all of that judgment, the brother or sister. You're going to have to deal with all of that judgment. So God go with you. God go with you. 39.99. Knock off. 2023. We witness that. But they link me. Send me a cash up. Trust me. I don't think you're a fool nobody. 39.99. Bop. $39.99 and flap like dog. Yep, see it? Continuity. The unbroken and consistent existence or operation of something over a period of time. Get it in your head and fret. Sleep and fret. Anytime you do fuckery to people, at some point you're going to have to sleep and fret. Because you know, say, you. Karma is drawing nigh. You know, so your judgment is drawing nigh. Especially if you live long. Because some people, wicked people think a long life means, you know, goodness and mercy and prosperity. And no, no, no. You just live long enough to deal with your existence, to deal with the consequences, to deal with the unbrokenness. Of your actions. That you know. Yeah. What you have become. A miserable blood class soul. And guess what? No matter how you take it, all things must be revealed. Yeah. So here we go now. I never choose to be the messenger. Me never choose that. Me never choose to have a voice. Me never choose to have talent. You see? Me never choose to be able to sing. Yeah? Me never go out there and choose the people who love me singing and make me into a person who have a platform or a voice. That means, say, 
What I am is greater than what you can never fathom. So me never choose to be the messenger. You know? my, bad, my mother name, my mother name Lucille. Lucille means the light bringer. But look it up. Lucille means the light bringer. And sometimes the light is shining, but here we no, it encounters darkness. You see? Until it gets to the place. The light, the sun goes behind the dark clouds. It no means that the sun is not there, you know. It just a deal with dark clouds. You see? So maybe it, it, it when when it's when, when, when the sun when the sun young when the sun the sun young when the sun just come out of the the the, 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 the solstice. You see? It may encounter some 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 dark days. And it's climbed out of the bowel of the earth. You know? But it no means it's not a sun. It's just, it's a sun <laughs> just encountering some obstacles. So me I had my fear share of obstacles. You see? I'm aware my scars them proudly. I'm aware my mistakes them proudly. Because it teach me say yo, do better next time. That's why my life is an open book because me never choose to be the messenger. So me just have to point out when the fuckery or your karma reach. <laughs> because me have to use it and show people say, you know, see what happened there, son? You know, see the money we used to get thirty, forty thousand dollars per show? You know, see the money we used to charge thousand and two thousand dollars per double plate? You know, see the money we sit down and try to tear down everybody else? Thirty nine, ninety nine. You see the man that we did that bond me out for a wind up on stage. Look on the go-go now. Look on the stripper. Look on the versus the versus the versus bitch walk. Look on it. Look on the little youth where you try to tear down. They're on the same platform with you and totally destroy the place. And you're up there, a wind up. Hmm? I let me see you sing a song with a girl with a hood in front of her name. And let me see you go down a digicel, go switch for your pocket change. And even after you tell the world, say switch. Because one time somebody could even get you for say the number two. You see? You make whole heap of people in Jamaica not even eat fish. And we come here, you are talking about people for switch now. For your pocket change. You see? And what them do? Use you for tell people for switch. Subliminally. And I know, say, it will get you. Because you, you plant a seed. You plant a seed. You plant a seed, and when everybody now starts switch, you come back out and you try to come get stripe off of Vegas. And failed miserably. You come out here and try to get a stripe off a little singer and fail miserably. You know why you fail? You know why you had to run like a thief and ball to your fans, them and your minions, them to save you? When them can't help you, them just take on your karma upon yourself. Because they don't understand, say, when you see problems and crosses, leave it alone. But they want to take on your karma, so they will join in your judgment. So you try to come now for robot to well left of Vegas. You, you, you robot, you robot, we are robot already. So you try to come for robot the rest of Vegas and run up in a fucking roadblock. You go up on stage and wind up like one bitch. The same show where you totally disrespect a brother, we go perform, never trouble you, nor call your name, nor look on you. You cut the man's performance, put on your page, set the man flap. And I say, your friend mash up the show. And I say, if this a artist. And that just say about the man, with the, when Alkaline performed at the same event, different location, you had an advantage because the event is in your backyard. Alkaline performed at the same event, basically. And the man going good. But because the artist going better, you take the youth performance, post it on your page, 
and I ask your minions them and even entertainers in the industry and that it a kick 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 and a laugh at teeth and a put up emoji and I try disrespect the youth because they see I do it too. That are the precedent where you set in a dance hall. And now we come see your flop and the same event and everybody has stay silent. No, we supposed to drag your fucking shame from Yasa to Jerusalem. We have to drag your shame. Because when you're going to point out someone else's flaws, make certain say you don't have none. If you're going to point out say something about me, then you have to go look in a year background. Understand that now? So you never did know say one day you're going to get to perform for the same event. You know, it never darn on you that you can't ridicule a youth of performance you know, because one day I'm going to have to perform on the same show. You see me now? I can ridicule you if you flap. You see? So even if me go and flap, and you go take it and cut it and post it, so me flap. I don't admit to the world already, so me not a stone. Me don't make the world know say, Yo, anybody can flap. Just do better next time. But no. Same way, the man put out the album, you put out statement. Everybody just hurry up and put out them like an idiot album, you know. And the whole industry you know, realize they disrespect everybody. Everybody just hurry up and put out them like an idiot album, you know. Because you swear my album drop, everything I've got pack up. When it's flat price, this an artist and an artist, this a two more artists. Flat price, flat price, my album a come. And you start put up artwork, and you start put up song with Snoop. And you start put up song with cartel. And you start put up song with, with, with everybody in the industry. You have song with you have song with everybody in the industry for your album. And all know you can't really see album. You know why? You are still afraid of the numbers. And the best thing could have happened for you, that little orchestrated clash here, will give you some form of presence in the industry again where you totally undermine and go on like say you did then away in your 39.99 you never then away you would at 39.99 you're still there you see 39.99 you would don't at all eight thousand dollar i know you can't put out the album where you say two years or three years pass and the album where you say I'm gonna be the biggest thing you have every you, the, the, listen me. The last time you hear you know, a Bob Marley sample, them I try to clear from your album, you know. So you have everybody and them mum up on your album. Because you're afraid of the truth. You're afraid of the continuity. That, that listen me, just when you do fuck in a life, you can't sleep. I know so you can't sleep you. And every time I get to remind you, me I go do it. Every time. Because it must be a lesson to people. Where people try to hold them. Where people try to mash up. Where people try to stigmatize. Where people try to bully. It must be a lesson to them to say, yo, don't give up. Because that thing there that is trying to pull you down. It's just misery looking company. Facts. Facts. 100% facts. I know you can't put out the album. Al Alkaline must do all a second album since that. And you can't put out the album yet. Because you're afraid. Say it go flap. And the vloggers them go say it flap. You're scared. You're scared. You're, af you're afraid you're fucked. You see? You're afraid you. 39.99. At that you should have afraid of. You never know. You, you, as as you're a brave man. You can't be that big star there where everybody at the house you're richer than me. Everybody at the house you're bigger than Vegas. Everybody at the house are you 39.99? You're idiot you. 39.99. Fake brand. Eh? When that even breeze can blow up, blow up on if he move. Tap here, man. Do better. But I don't know if you can because 
Your judgment day are you. And I will be here to to give an analysis of it. You see? Me no say me no say me a go day of favor, you know. Me no say me can't get sick, you know. Me no say nothing can happen to me, you know. Me I will never say that because it's a skin, flesh and bone. So anything can happen at any time. But one thing for sure, say me already set my house in order. One thing for sure, say my father with dead left nothing give me. Now I go happen to my children then. That one thing for sure. Yeah. One thing for sure. You see? And if I go do no more Clash lyrics, I go do a song named 3999. And I go put you up in your fake brand so don't start back no Clash. Because it is going to be personal. Do not start back any Clash. Because I'm going to put you up in your fake 3999 knockoff. Do not start back any clash because your minions them I go and beg me to stop talk about the 39.99 cause they love ball you see they love to ball alright so do not start no clash because I go write a song named 39.99 you see big up on yourself enjoy the night Always do good and make goodness follow you. You do fuckery in your life, fuckery going to follow you. And there's gonna be an agitator to you. You see? If you point it out. So this one name, the end of 39.99. 39.99. No wonder Claudia left your bumbo cloud. <laughs> <laughs> 